Good morning. My name is Clyde Sumner. I'm with Campers Inn RV in Jacksonville, Florida. I'm a 20 year sales rep in the RV industry. I've been working with the Newmar products for over 15 years now. One of the biggest deals ever on a Newmar motorhome and from their entry level, if you could call it Bay Star Sport, right on up to this half million dollar Dutch Star, the construction is the same. The slide rooms are the best in the industry. When you look at this slide and it's in, this is a nice tight flush fit. Everybody else, this part of the slide room is overhanging the, the wall of the motor home. That allows for air, water leaks, things of that nature. The quietest motor home on the market is a Newmar. When you start looking at it, how they seal these Newmars up, everybody runs a little caulking on their seams. Every seam on this Newmar is caulked, but there is twice the caulking on this camper as anybody else's. This one has the uh, really nice thick insulated compartment doors. Uh, these are slam latches. There's a button on the in the door where you can lock and unlock every compartment on this motorhome with just a touch of a button, or you can certainly go around with the key and do it if you prefer. But this one we brought in with this nice Dometic. This thing's a cooler, it's a deep freezer, it's whatever you want to use it for. It runs off 12 volt battery, it also runs off electricity. We brought it in with this nice slide out tray just to make that easy for you to get to your things that are in there. If you want to keep your beverages cold, you can go to Alaska, get yourself some halibut and pack them in there and uh, keep them ice down. This one we've also brought in with outside entertainment. These are Samsung top of the line TV. Get a Bose surround bar out here. Plenty of storage on this 4369 Dutch Star. This will slide from this side. You can also slide it from the coach to the other side, but anything you want to put on there, you can easily access. All these new Mars are powder coated up underneath here. If you look at that, there's plenty of powder coating. You don't have to worry about rust and things of that nature, folks that are up north on these uh, icy salty roads. Here's another compartment that uh, I could put you a uh, slide out tray in there if you like. This is where you dump your central back system. We'll get to that when we get inside. This little part here, Newmar puts this cork board thing in here. A lot of guys want to hang some tools, maybe extension cords, you know, things of that nature you can, uh, can do there. This coach is also equipped as we're going along. It's got like seven cams outside. They call it a 360 view. But you can see all the way around this coach, what is a security system. It's also on board, you know, for side cams, rear cams, all those things. There's a cam up on the nose. So if you're parking somewhere close, you can see exactly where you're at. But uh, everything is designed for safety in mind. And uh, the more you see, the safer you can be. This particular Dutch Star is brought in on the K2 Spartan chassis. It also is equipped with docking lights. You're coming in at a campground at night, you turn these on, it shines up the ground around you. Hopefully you don't run over anybody's sewer hose or anything like that. But uh, not everybody puts those on their diesels when you're looking around. I mean, look for little things like this, because these are things you don't notice till you don't have it. This one is also equipped with the uh, ultra steer. This tag axle, if you're turning less than 20 miles an hour, it's gonna turn with you to help the tail end of this coach get around the corner but it, it's been out a few years now. It's uh, pretty much bulletproof. After 20 miles an hour, it's locked in straight. And, uh, there's absolutely no problem there. These little compartments back here, your DEF fluid right here. New Marfa's a clear one on there. It's just where you can see what you've got in there. These are the uh, chassis batteries. That's what's cranking your motor home. There's a couple of disconnect switches in here. When you get ready to store it, you flip those off. It kills all the juice to the house. Hopefully when you get back, you're going to have good strong batteries to crank up and get on your next trip. This coach is equipped with the 450 horsepower Cummins engine. Of course, the five year, 100,000 mile warranty on that Cummins. It is uh, standard with a six speed automatic Allison transmission. This coach is also equipped with a 10,000 pound hitch. It'll tow pretty much uh, any vehicle you'd like to hook to it. Mars went ahead and put the air line on this for people that are towing with the air braking system. That makes it easy for my service department and for you to make that change over you know, from whatever you're uh, driving now to this Dutch door.
here's another one of those 360 cameras down here so you can keep a really good eye on tow vehicles things of that nature there's another one up here for uh, observation as you're going down the highway you can keep an eye on what's happening behind you Here's that side radiator. Side radiator runs cooler, maybe get you a little better fuel economy out of that, but it is a more desirable radiator, which comes with the 450 Cummins. This little door here, you'll see this is Newmar's emergency escape. Instead of the window that most folks aren't capable of crawling out of, this is a door that opens. There's a ladder that uh, will fall out similar to what you'd find on a boat, but uh, you, hopefully you never have to use it, but if you do, that is uh, got to be some peace of mind right there. But even this is sealed up nice and tight, just like the slide room. Newmar wants this coach to be as quiet as possible, and it is super quiet. Here's another station there for DEF fluid only. This exhaust is for the, uh, we'll see that in a moment. That's for the hot water system. The water hose is on a power cord reel. Your water filter system right here, everything goes into the coach is water filtered. So, uh, this makes it easy to get to that and change the filter when you need to. But everything you need is right here. There's your uh, pump. They've also uh, hooked on a macerator to this thing. So uh, that makes it easy dealing with a two inch hose. Simply clip on your uh, sandy thing and it chews everything up and keeps everything nice and clean and very, very easy to work with. There's that 50 amp uh, cord. That's on a nice power reel. Anybody's ever had a motorhome, any kind of camper, without a power reel, you know that thing can be a booger to deal with, especially in cold weather. This takes a, that makes that job very easy of retracting that, uh, that 50 amp power cord. And there's also a light in there. There's some cables, satellite hookups, things of that nature right there. There's the Oasis. That is also, uh, that's hot water. It runs off diesel fuel. It runs off electric. That's also runs the furnace in, in this coach. I'll show you some of that when we get up, get in the inside. Best hot water system on the market is that. Shower all day long if you want to. Uh, plenty of hot water for sinks and showers and things like that, but never ending. Here's the backside of that slide out tray. These doors, they slip down. Newmar has designed this a couple of years ago, but what it does, it actually allows them to give you a, a bigger door, more access to your things over here, the way they've designed this door. House batteries right here. Uh, this is a slide out tray. You can slide those uh, batteries out there. If you're a do-it-yourself guy, you want to do your own battery maintenance. The folks that get a life out of the battery, they do their maintenance. So if you keep a check on things like that, It'll save you trouble and money down the road. Check out the slides, folks, because the best slide in the industry is on a Newmar. 1991, Malin Miller built the first uh, Class A motorhome with a power slide on it. And it is still the best slide in the industry. Many people call him the goose that laid the golden egg. I have met Mr. Miller in person. He told me he never intended to be a uh, RV guy, that he wanted to be a farmer. He said, and I am a farmer. He says, I've got a farm. He said, but everything I touched in the RV industry turned to gold. He is truly one of the pioneers, but this is still unmatched in the RV industry. This coach is built 16 inch or less on center aluminum C channel stud. It is a hung fiberglass. You'll never ever see a Newmar delaminating. Their walls are three inches thick. There's one high-end fifth wheel manufacturer I'm aware of that does three inch thick walls, nobody else. Quietest coach going down the road, quietest coach in the campground is a Newmar. There's a ton of insulation in there and it's unmatched in this industry. It also has the diamond shield on the front. This is a protective mask that uh, rocks, road debris, things of that nature, it'll protect you from. There's another one of those cameras up here, the 360 that we talked about. This hood pops right up here so you can uh, get to your generator if you like. There's no little arm or anything you gotta do. It makes it easy. Newmar's you know, overthinking these, but we're gonna start the gen right here. The awnings on this Newmar Dutch Star are top of the line, Gerard awnings. They're to kind of come out, and as you can see, they tilt to uh, block more sunlight from you. There's two power awnings plus the door awning, but you've got patio area, almost the whole 43 foot length of your motor home. So if you like to entertain, have people hanging out under the awning, the Gerard awnings are the best in the industry. 
everything about the cockpit of the Newmar Dutch Star. It's designed with your comfort and uh, safety in mind. But uh, flex steel furniture, the Thomas Field of RV furniture. This one, as we looked outside, is on the Spartan chassis. It has the uh, touch pad, automatic uh, six-speed Allison transmission. This coach is equipped with HWH, customized leveling. It is a hydraulic system. It is the best, in my opinion, on the market. Little things they do, they put, put your power window here. But your engine brake uh, stuff is up in here. You got a high, medium, and low, a three-stage engine brake. You can disable your tag uh, axle from here, but remember this does have the ultra steer, so uh, that does save the tires if they're not dragging and, and things, you know, that nature of the old style that don't have that. Right on up from the uh, Country Star, right on up to their top of the line, and certainly this Dutch Star are all equipped with Comfort Drive, exclusive on a Newmar motorhome. The Comfort Drive is a system that takes the wheel and it's always looking for the center of the road. This coach, you can turn the wheel all the way around. You can let it go and it's coming back to the center of the road. Um, very, very easy. Up. One finger will turn that wheel around. Backing up, turning a corner, let the wheel go, it's gonna come back to the center. When you're on the highway and those crosswinds and things out west, this is looking for the center road. It's gonna help you stay in your lane. It's gonna help you stay straight and help you stay safe. This wheel, this little pedal down here to the left of the column, it tilts the wheel, it also telescopes it. Used to on the new Mar, there was a little knob for that uh, comfort drive where you could adjust the settings. Now on this uh, Spartan chassis, it's on the uh, dashboard. What they're trying to do is keep your hands on the wheel as much as possible. To get to the comfort drive, I would use my arrows here going up. I'm gonna go to settings, I'm gonna hit okay. There's my comfort drive right there. I can hit okay on that. And then there's my tension. I can come all the way down to one, being the easiest the wheel is gonna turn. Or I can go all the way up to five, which makes the steering tighter. But uh, everything now is designed to keep your hands on the wheel, your eyes on the highway. Um, the other settings are in here, your trip, info, things like that. I can go back home and I can go to the info here and do some different things. I can change uh, my tire pressure monitoring system right there. Big time uh, safety feature, in my opinion, on, on any camper. Adaptive cruise control, you know, on the distances. You can come back up here, you can adjust the brightness of your dash. Sometimes that night maybe it's too bright in your face, so uh, you can ease that down. There's some messages, which we have none. Here's the settings again. Go back up here to units. Temperature, I can do my speed, I can do the uh, pressure down here. <clears throat> TSIs, you know, if you want the, uh, and just head on back here. Uh, you can even adjust the stereo sound up and down right here. Um, many different features on this wheel very simple to operate uh, once you get the hang of it, it you'll like it a hot, lot better this is a booster for your uh, chassis house batteries what that does it connects those cranking batteries we saw outside to those uh house batteries but if you had to jump yourself you know from the house to the chassis or vice versa you can do that by simply pushing this button um, on and off for, for headlights here, bright and dim here. There's a visor over here that's power for your side if the sun's coming in over here. This, with the engine running, is your sun visor. It allows this two-stage shade to come down that far if you need it for a sun visor. If that's not enough, you could bring down the solid and it will also come down, you know, that far for sun visor. And once you turn the engine off, you could bring either one of them all the way down for privacy or shade. There are fans up in here for defrosting, circulating air. They're not the fans that are stuck up in the, the side that you can see and make a lot of noise. These are very quiet. They're hidden, but they do a, a fantastic job. This, uh, remember we talked about the uh, 3D camera system outside. From this view, you're looking at your uh, side cams and your rear cams. Okay, from this view over here, I can go to camera and uh, I can switch back and forth from 
beach camera that's around this coach from right here. So it's very easy. You can use it for security at night if you want to see what's going around. It tells you which camera you're looking at. Uh, then I can switch back to navigation. That's a pretty cool feature on this because this is the RV or info. In other words, you can put how heavy, how tall, how long you are in here, how wide you are. This uh, GPS navigation will keep you off of roads and places that you should not be on with a motorhome this size. It'll also tell you along your route uh, stations that are easily accessible for fuel restaurants. If you want to stop in a place that you can get in and out of with a rig like this. Both of these seats been around. They become part of your living area once you get part. They're both power recliners. They're heated seats, but uh, very comfortable seating, but you can do a lot of entertaining in the uh, 4369 Dutch Star. Nice, big, plush, comfortable recliners here. You can adjust your TV here, we got a televator. Entertain, there's another Samsung TV coming up here, another Bose surround bars. All your lights are on these little touch pads right here, but you can turn lights off and on throughout the coach from just the touch of the pad. What we talked about outside, the 16 inch on center aluminum C channel studs, that allows Newmar to run wiring through the walls. That's why you see your plugs, your wall sockets, things of that nature in the wall, a residential style build residential style features uh, come along with it. This is a little sleeper sofa if you had overnight guests, certainly accommodate them. All the floors in this new mar are heated. There's different levels. You can set this for one temperature, that another. New mar doesn't run water up underneath the uh, floors on these for heating. They have an electric uh, system that, that does a really good job and uh, we've had zero issues with it that I'm aware of. This slide room, or as far as I know, Numar is the only one I've seen putting tile in the slide. There's absolutely no carpet in this motorhome. That's a hand laid porcelain tile, just like the rest of the floor. This slide, best in the industry, comes straight up and straight in. We have never had an issue with any tiles in these Numar Dutch stores. That's been out at least five years now, I would say. This coach is all electric. There is no propane on board. Um, induction cooktops, a microwave convection. You need a little extra counter space. You can certainly pull that out. But every, everything's just like you would expect at home. A big stainless steel sinks, double stainless steel, big nice faucets, residential style. It's good heavy duty stuff. All the cabinetry, when you get to the new bar, there is no pressed particle, anything. These are all solid wood cabinets and cabinet door rods. A lot of manufacturers, this is real wood. This is a wrapped pine. Outside, we saw the Oasis hot water system. I was telling you, that's also the heating system. Behind these little vents, there are no vents in the floor. But behind this little vent, it's like a small radiator. Hot water circulates through that radiator, fan blows out hot air, and all this is working from the Oasis hot water system. But uh, no propane on board, remember. But the result, people that have used these have told me it's easy on the sinuses, it's easy on your fabrics and things like that versus propane heat. But it is a cleaner, smoother, easier kind of heat, and it works fantastic. Dinette table for two here. There is a leaf comes with it. You simply pull this out, insert the leaf that's uh, back up underneath the bed. And there are a couple of other folding chairs that come out here. If you had company, four people can certainly sit here and uh, have a meal. Residential refrigerator, I think is one of the best things to happen to the uh, motor home in a long time. These are hooked to thousand watt inverters that runs this constantly going down the road. There's no issues works just fine. You can go in and out of it, unlike the gas electric where they have to be level. Folks who run propane going down the road never want to see legal and it is a fire hazard. It's not recommended that you do that. The uh, electric refrigerator, bigger fridge, thousand watt inverter, running down the road, constantly charging, absolutely no issues. I think that's a, a, a very nice feature in any RV. This little door, Numar actually patented the way this door opens with the slide room in it allows you uh, easier access in and out of the half bath here as you can see large porcelain uh, potties uh, the bowl style sinks that a lot of folks love fantastic fan in there ac duct going in there look around for things like that because i've seen motorhomes they do not drop the ac duct in the bathroom and uh be uncomfortable we've uh, with this dutch star with a king size 
his and her air mattress, sleep number, you can set up whatever feels good to you. This coach also has three 15,000 BTU roof airs. All three have uh, electric heat pumps in them. But uh, no matter where you travel, you can stay comfortable in the new Mar Dutch store. Plenty of uh, wardrobe space in this new Mar Dutch store. It's got uh, his and hers, or hers and hers closets, however they work out. But uh, plenty of place to hang all your clothes. All these drawers fully extend their nice, big, deep, solid wood drawers. Uh, soft clothes drawers. Here's another Samsung TV for the bedroom. Soft touch here, soft touch seat on here. Newmar's dressed up the air conditioning system in here. There's a couple of stereo speakers back here if you want to listen to your music. Uh, you can control all that from the dash to back here. There's plugs on either side of the bed. USBs, 110, but anything that you need to plug into, there's plenty of room for that. Coming into the full bathroom in the 4369 Dutch Star. It's equipped with a stack washer dryer. A lot of folks prefer a stack washer dryer over the combo. There's a privacy pocket door here. Simply pull that out. out of for privacy here. Giant glass shower enclosure, all ceramic tile shower here. It's got grab handles. It's got a folding seat, that teak wood. You can fold it if it's in your way. It's got the hot water indicator in there. There's a couple of different shower heads in there. Whatever makes you comfortable. Coming over here, you got a giant porcelain potty. It is a uh, power flush. Push one button, fills uh, the bowl. Another button flush, flushes the bowl. There's a um, assist handle here. There's also your emergency door exit that we saw from the outside, but in case of emergency, you had to exit the coach, open the door, ladder falls out. You can climb to safety right there versus climbing out of our competitor's windows. A lot more closet space, shelves. These shelves you can take out. There's more hanging if you wanted to. Here's a... Uh, Plenty of hanging space here, place for shoes. There's a uh, electronic safe back up in there. Uh, we'll show you how to set your own code that uh, can keep all your valuables up in there. But there's a lot of storage in here for clothes. Medicine cabinet over here. There's also another one here, so you can have his and hers uh, medicine cabinets. There's GFI outlets around the uh, sink area for whatever you may need to plug in back here. Residential style faucets. They've already hung in the things for your towels and things of that nature. All your light buttons are right over here. Fantastic fan. I've got a fantastic fan in my RV. I would not have a, an RV without it. This coach has got three or four of them in it. But they move a lot of air. They do a fantastic job. From here is a good place to see the Newmar AC system. You notice there's a, a row of uh, this whole row throughout the coach are return ducts. These are blowing cold air out. The advantage to that, it uh, kind of distributes the noise of the roof air conditionings. These are whisper quiet ACs, all three 15,000 BTUs, all three have electric heat pumps. But the way Newbar's AC circulates up through here, it is the quietest air conditioning system on the market. If you've had those, it's got the one big square return that's making a lot of noise. You're up and down with the TV, things of that nature. You know how aggravating that can be. This is less than half the noise of what you're listening to in a traditional ducted system. The new Mar Dutch Star, there's way too many things in a, in a short video to touch on, but I'd love to show you in person. Come see Clyde Sumner Campers in Jacksonville North. I'll be glad to help you.